Hello everybody, I hope you are all doing very well and welcome back to another cryptocurrency technical analysis. After another very good day of trading today, I am going to be going through in this video the parallel channel that you see on the screen right now, which is the parallel channel to be trading from. It has been absolutely perfect. Uh, so let's start with this and then I'll move on to a few altcoins at the end of the video. But I'm going to be trying to make this fairly swift because I am still in positions. So here we are right here on Bitcoin. As you know, yesterday we left off yesterday's video looking at a different parallel channel. Uh, let's quickly free draw this out for you. We were looking at the parallel channel more or less like this, okay? Well, we had our support up to resistance, down to support. Then we got another touch on support up to the top of the channel, down to the midpoint, up to the top. We never hit the middle of the channel. OK, we never hit the middle of this channel this time, which is obviously showing bullish signs. You do, you come down briefly, hold upon the midpoint, you know, not touching it. Then we get a higher low, then we break up. OK, what I would also like to show you really quickly here is obviously where this candle come down to old resistance. All these are uh, badly free drawn pictures, but old resistance, okay, old resistance flipping into support, we move up, okay. So this was yesterday, the scalping range that I was doing on Bitcoin, and then this transcended into a new channel that I've been playing over the last 24 hours, okay. So from this parallel channel, which we obviously broke out of bullishly last night, we come up to the top, okay, top of our last wicked area, okay. So obviously when you see this red candle here on the five minutes, we came up, briefly got above it, okay, briefly got above it, but you obviously came straight, you know, qu quite rapidly back down after breaking above, okay. And then that's where we formed this second parallel channel. At first I had this slightly above, but then as we got the more relevant touches down here, slightly adjusted back down, but this is what I've been sculpting off of today. OK, and I just want to really quickly cover this because this is really important that your mentality is so important in trading. OK, as you all know, I was in a short position before the breakup, so I lost some money on that short. And it's very easy to if you lose a trade to become uh, very negative, thinking that you're going to go on a losing streak, etc, etc. Um, and I, you know, I really want to focus on this because this was a tweet that I put out what yesterday um, saying uh, Ask yourself this question now of all of the confident people you have ever met in your life, how many of them have had, had a constantly negative outlook or attitude? I bet it's going to be a very small percentage or none. Moving on to successful and confident people tend to have a positive or opt optimistic attitude because when you focus on the positive, you have positive results. OK, this is true when it comes to trading. A winner has a winner's mentality. And if you have a winner's mentality, you are going to get winning trades. OK. You cannot go into trading with a bad mentality. When I took a loss yesterday, I did not think bad. I did not think negative thoughts. I just moved on, got over the loss and moved straight on to trading. With that coming out, I just wanted to really stress this because it's so important not to get down in trading. You you have to think like a winner. You have to think like a chart champion. Yes. <laughs> so here we go on to the next suite of the days where I was obviously saying altcoins are going to be fun today trading. Absolutely true. Uh, aka Bitcoin Cash Cardano. What a amazing day for those. Uh, yeah, they're moving on to the next week, obviously saying this was freely, freely tweeted. Uh, you could have also got on, on the move that's happened today. Uh, obviously saying that, um, yeah, yesterday I lost 6k, but guess what? I've made it all back uh, because I literally spent 32 hours uh, as I was going to go to bed yesterday. Uh, we got the break from the parallel channel upwards. Uh, so I literally uh, have not really slept a lot, but just done a lot of sculpting. Uh, because this is like a thing that some traders will have a day rule that when they hit, obviously professional full-time traders will generally have a rule saying, you know, let's say they ha they have a target of their daily target. Once their ta daily target is hit, they stop trading. I don't do that. If I hit my daily target, which I do have a daily target, but I do not stop trading because if I'm on a winning streak, why would I stop? Okay, I generally, if I start the day poorly, I will then stop trading. But if I go on a winning streak, I do not stop trading because I've hit my daily target. I carry on because you get a feel and the, you get a feel for the momentum. You get a feel for everything. You get a feel for the charts. And it's just like you can predict where it's going. And, you know, I have been very bullish um, on Bitcoin and the altcoins over the literally the last 24 hours, just entering into lots, lots of long positions because I really, truly believe that we are going to be moving up. Um, so, yeah, that's why, uh, yeah, it's just was really important to show you that, you know, um, yeah, I took the loss and I got over it and I went on and won some more money through long positions. Uh, that's literally what I've been doing today, longs on crypto and different altcoins. And it was, yeah, amazing. And obviously, this was the channel that I pointed out to you all. OK, and shortly, probably about 10 minutes after posting this, we come down and touch the bottom where you could have got into a long at around 5000, um, you know, off of the bottom of this channel again. OK, oh, wow, we are moving up right now. OK, so this is good for me. I'm, I mean, I'm going to wrap this up quite quickly. Oh, wow. You see this. OK, so my 
resistance trend line. Okay, so this is kind of live right now. My resistance trend line that I've had for a very long time now at 5,181, uh, getting rejected the top here, 5,179. Very close, but obviously the momentum is still with the bulls. Okay, momentum's definitely still with the bulls. And we could be getting a break right now. I want to try and wrap this up right quite quickly because I want to uh, manage some of my positions. But yeah, this is good for me. I'm in long, so it doesn't really matter too much. But yeah, this is nice. Um, so here we are breaking above the resistance right now. Um, yeah, brilliant. Let's, let's see if this actually gets momentum. If not, then I will try, want to, you know, um, I'm going to try and wrap this up quite quickly. But yeah, this is obviously just simply scoping from the bottom of the trend line to the top. Bottom, <clears throat> excuse me, from the bottom, adding to position, adding to position, adding to position, adding to the position. Midpoint, I took profits. We come down. Where do we do, where did we hold on support? You can kind of see this trend line in here as a midpoint where you come down, hold the midpoint, come back into the long position. And now, uh, yeah, I would be taking profits again right now. Uh, to be honest, if I was not doing this video, I would be taking profits right now from the long that obviously you say so you, you long midpoint, come back down halfway, re-enter that long up to the top of the channel. But obviously this, you know, is a little bit different because I have the resistance trend line that we're looking at. So I would be taking profits right now. Um, but yeah, I've been literally killing this channel so well, <laughs> so, so, so well. Um, and you might say to yourself, Daniel, why did you not trade it to the top of this channel? Um, you, why, why take profits on the middle? Uh, because you have to take profits on the middle when you see like this, obviously, uh, that, that like that you would t obviously take profits on the middle and this was quite nice obviously uh, Pravin, one of my average students asking me, um, you know, is this a valid parallel channel? Yes, it is. So I posted it on Twitter previously, but, you know, should it hit the top of the upper channel? Yes, you would expect it for, to go from bottom to top. But remember, at some point it has to break. Midpoint, also major resistance as it lines up with the top. Thanks. Isn't this amazing? Um, yes, it actually is. But not so much amazing, but more great technical analysis. Um, you know, you, I really just have a feel for these charts. And when I go on a winning streak, I just feel so connected. And, you know, it's just amazing how like predictions and, you know, identifying the correct channels, etc, 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 just really come to fruition. Um, yeah, I am proud <laughs> that, uh, yeah, I'm good at technical analysis, uh, not bragging, but yeah, it really am. <laughs> so here we obviously covered this tweet um yeah so obviously we as you can see right now we are getting rejected from the 5181 that i've had listed out here for um you know the last few days as, as this is the resistance level so uh gonna speed this up let's try and finish in two minutes because i want to take some profits not close out totally because again i am still getting an overall bullish feel for these coins but um yeah, you want to be taking profits here to protect yourself if this is going to be a resistance and we end up moving down, obviously. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, uh, I was going to quickly cover uh, Bitcoin Cash and Cardano, but um, obviously this was what I tweeted out. What time was this tweeted out? At around 20 past two, uh, 20 past two. And I actually wrote saying since finding support on the 200 exponential moving average this morning, Bitcoin Cash has been running lovely. All eyes on the 55 exponential moving average. Move not over until we lose that support. Guess what? We since this tweet, we moved up another 10 percent. Absolutely crazy, amazing, life-changing moves that you can be making right here, right now. This is why it was such a massive winning day for me. You see here, just literally sculpting that we you come down, touch the 200, it begins. We're on the three-minute chart. Okay, moving up, finding support on the 55, 12, 12, uh, 12, sorry, 26, 26, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12. Another touch on here, another touch. We actually got down to the 26 and touched it. This is where you're adding to positions. You're adding until you lose support. Okay, so this is why it's such like a, an amazing day for me. Uh, just seeing here, you see, this is like really perfect and exactly as I expected. You know, getting resistance here and it, a bit annoying that I didn't take profits. Uh, this is obviously now turning into a bit of a shooting star candle. Let's wrap this up. Uh, so yeah, I just really wanted to show you uh, Cardano as well, which is obviously just being this again is on the five minute chart I'm looking at here. I mean. Absolutely amazing. Okay, Litecoin, another one. Absolutely amazing. Really similar chart. Okay, this is just you know play to your EMAs and just yeah, absolutely kill it with me because it's really been a really successful day of trading. Um, just yeah, eager to sort out my position here. So sorry I had to wrap this video up quite quickly. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to show you all this channel and how it has been so well respected literally you know after we broke above that first parallel channel use that parallel channel as support 
okay that you could see like this for example when we go along you know uh, yeah, this is obviously very free drawn not drawn out drawn out exactly but you know you break up above hold it as support move up hold it as a support kind of again here move up making high lows high lows high lows just dragging along the top of the bottom of the parallel channel uh, breaking up to the midpoint breaking up to the uh, resistance this is a old weekly resistance that i've had mapped out for a very long time um so this is like a really big one and it's you know you, nothing is random i've said it time and time again this is not a random re reason that we're getting rejected from this and this is a you know a, a, for example you i would uh on one exchange be obviously where i'm in a long taking profits and in another exchange shorting this because it is a resistance level um so yeah, like you can be in long positions and short positions simultaneously if you are on more than one exchange, more than one account, etc. Out of interest, how much percentage? Yeah, this is like 0.8%. You know, you use times 10 leverage <laughs> to 8%. Um, yeah, I mean... Yeah, I want to want to go and sort this position out because I want to trade this, actually, to be honest. Uh, I have loved, 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 loved today of trading. It's been one of my most successful, profitable days in a while um, just because it's just been full on volatile. Uh, I love, love trading volatile movements with these sculpts. I'm going to be looking for swing trades as well soon. Uh, but yeah, sculpting, I absolutely love it. And obviously, this is this is lovely to see. Um, you know, I was a little bit bored when you move sideways for an extended period of time and range trading. Although, yes, I like range tra trading as well, where you just trade the, the range sideways. But volatile movements up and down are, are much better because there's much more profits to be had. I mean, yeah. Bitcoin cash, this was up over 30, 40 percent in 24 hours. It's like absolutely amazing. Um, but yeah, this I just wanted to bring your eyes to this parallel channel because obviously it's still in play right now. We're just at the midpoint of the channel. But you would expect if we actually break above 5,182 to, you know, fire up a little bit um you know just just keep your eye on this channel it's i've been trading it over the last 24 hours and it's and it's made me a lot of money and you just want to make sure that if you know for example that you break above exactly like you saw last time that you like break up and hold it or if you break down from here then you'd want to be aware of like where we're this trend line resistance if you obviously support apologies if you break down and retest that then obviously you could be looking for scope short positions Okay, so I really just wanted to bring your attention to this. Um, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. It's been an absolute joy. Uh, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed. Please give me a thumbs up uh, if you've enjoyed this one. I really do hope it's been beneficial. Sorry that it had to be cut short. I was going to cover some more things in this video. But yeah, I hope you can appreciate that I do want to trade this right now. <laughs> um, so yeah, thank you everybody for watching. And uh, yeah, all, go, all goes back to have that winner's mentality. Surround yourself by positive people. Um, I'm very positive. I love trading. So yeah say hello. <laughs> thank you for, for, thank you everybody for watching and uh, yeah, enjoy your, enjoy the week to come in trading. It is going to be absolutely amazing. So happy, so pumped and yeah, just enjoy it. Thank you everybody. Cheers.